For couples who have made the decision to embark on the in vitro fertilization journey, there are many ups and downs. Their hope is for a healthy baby and pre-implantation genetic testing for aneuploidies or PGTA is a test that can help to improve the chances of a successful pregnancy. PGTA is a genetic test that can be performed on embryos produced through IVF to screen for chromosomal abnormalities. The term pre-implantation is used because testing is performed on embryos during the time before they would naturally implant into the uterus, usually after day six. PGTA is offered as a complement to the patient's IVF treatment. PGTA is available to any patient, but is typically prescribed for couples where the female patient is of advanced maternal age. Patients who have experienced recurrent pregnancy losses both naturally and or through IVF, and patients who have experienced recurrent implantation failure. The benefits of PGTA include increased pregnancy rates per transfer, reduced time between IVF cycles and therefore overall time to pregnancy, reduced miscarriage rates, and more confidence in single embryo transfers, avoiding the associated risks with multiple birth pregnancies. The process for PGTA testing is as follows. Embryos are created by the fertility clinic. The embryologist will biopsy three to five trophectoderm cells, or TE cells, from a day five blastocyst stage embryo. Each embryo's TE cells are tubed separately and sent to the next genetics laboratory. The biopsied embryos remain at the fertility clinic and are stored frozen until the day of transfer. Next Genetics receives the TE cell samples. The samples undergo DNA amplification to prepare them for PGTA testing. Next Genetics uses the very seek PGS assay for testing of each individual sample, representative of each individual embryo. The PGTA results for each embryo will guide the selection process for choosing the embryos with a higher chance of achieving a successful pregnancy to be transferred. <laughs>